Clicker Communicator is the child-friendly AAC app that gives a voice to learners with speech and language difficulties. It uses the familiar Clicker apps interface, including the Sassoon font, making it perfect for the classroom as well as for general communication. You'll notice that there are no toolbars and no clutter, making the screen very accessible for students of all ages and abilities. When you've completed your message, just tap anywhere on the message to speak it. I want to go to school. Clicker Communicator comes with high quality children's voices, and more voices are available as free downloads. Three ready-made vocabulary sets are provided so that you can get started right away at the appropriate level. This one is Clicker Core 2, the middle level. All are built using core communication words with Fitzgerald color coding laid out in a logical and consistent format. This research-based approach ensures that students have rapid access to a rich vocabulary. To open a different vocabulary set, tap the tab to reveal the toolbar, then tap the Explorer button. This is Clicker Core 1, the simplest of the ready-made sets. It has fewer symbols and makes more use of phrases. Can I have more ice cream? At the other end of the scale, we have Clicker Core 3, the most comprehensive of the ready-made sets. I want to wear my t-shirt. This set also provides access to the child-friendly keyboard with symbol-supported word prediction. I want yogurt with blueberries. If it's difficult to target the cells, turn on Super Keys, our unique access method. The cells are now grouped into clusters. First tap the cluster, then tap the word you want. Super Keys enables users with a range of motor control difficulties to access comprehensive vocabulary sets. I like it here. Single and two switch scanning options are also available. It's very easy to edit vocabulary sets to make them more personally relevant. Just open the toolbar and then tap the edit button. Now select the cell that you want to edit and add some text. Clicker Communicator comes with over 24,000 fully indexed symbol stick symbols, but if you prefer to use widget or PCS symbols, these libraries are available as in-app purchases. The Crick Picture Library is also included, providing a rich library of curriculum pictures. You can add your own photos too. I'll rearrange the pictures add the children's names and color code them in specific classroom situations you'll want to provide access to special vocabulary Learning Grids is our online library of ready-made vocabulary sets covering a range of classroom topics. In Clicker Explorer, tap Learning Grids and browse or search for the set you want. In order to understand and internalize new concepts, students need to actually use the vo relevant vocabulary. So sets like this give those with speech and language impairments much more of an equal opportunity in the classroom. Glass is smooth and transparent. Now let's see just how easy it is to make your own vocabulary set from scratch. We're going to create a simple set that will enable a student to talk about the types of animals. Here's what a finished set will look like. It enables me to participate in a classroom discussion. For example, the teacher holds up a picture of a turtle and asks the class, what kind of animal is this? 
It is a reptile. And I can also make statements like this. A human is a mammal. Okay, let's see how we would actually go about creating a vocabulary set like this. First, we'll create our new vocabulary set in Clicker Explorer. Give the set a name. Decide on the number of cells and use the Tools button to select the tools to include on the grid. I'm going to have the Delete and Favorites and I'll put them on the right. Now let's open the set. On the home grid, let's start by adding the small words. I'm going to do this the fast way by tapping the Add Text button. Notice that the symbols are added automatically. Let's drag these into place. And now we'll add the animal type words in the same way. The fish symbol isn't what we want, so let's change that. When I tap the picture button, all the symbols for the word fish are shown. We'll choose this one. And now let's add some color coding. That's our home topic done. Now let's add our animals topic by tapping the add button on the left. I can add any number of topics here. You can see the animal topic now listed on the left and a link to it has been created on the home grid. We'll just drag that to the corner here. I can also color code the cell. Now let's select the animals topic on the left. A link to the home grid has been created automatically so all I need to do here is to add some animals. We'll add these by tapping the pictures icon. Because we're in a topic called animals, it automatically shows us the animals folder in the symbols library. Now we just browse and select the symbols we want. I can also search. When I tap done, all the pictures are added. I can drag them into position and we'll also add some small words. and I'll color code all the cells. Now my vocabulary set is ready to use. When I want to go back to my main communication set, I just tap Favorites. This gives me the freedom to move easily between my main communication set and any curriculum-based sets. So in addition to providing a comprehensive communication aid for everyday use, Clicker Communicator creates new opportunities for participating verbally in the classroom, which is so important for a child's cognitive development. Find out more about Clicker Communicator on our website or buy on the App Store now.